you got, got tied, tied up. up. Well, no, just handcuffed a little. Girl, I don't know who this mess is you hanging out with, but he is hazardous to your health. That's for sure. But I can't leave him. Well, why not? Because he'd get angry. I mean, if he does this to me when he likes me, imagine what he'd do if he ever got mad. So dumb. Chum, find a new man. Let him protect you. Mm -hmm. And we got one all picked out. A little botanical genius. And she ain't talking about George Washington Carver. Mm -hmm. Seymour? Bingo. Bingo! Oh, I could never be Seymour's girl. We're just friends. And besides, I got a past. And uh, who amongst us has not? I don't even deserve a sweet, considerate, suddenly successful guy like Seymour. Mm -mm -mm. You know, this girl, she has low self-image. You have a point. Mm -hmm. She have a problem. I know Seymour is the greatest, but I'm dating a semi-sadist. So I got a black eye and my arms in a cast. Huh. Mm. Still that Seymour cutie <laughs> well if not he's got inner beauty and I dream of a place where we could be together at last what kind of place is that an emergency room mm -hmm. Mm -mm. oh no it's just a daydream of mine a little development I dream of just off the interstate not fancy like Levittown just a little street in a little suburb Far, far from urban skid row. The sweetest, greenest place. Where everyone has the same little lawn out in front and the same little flagstone patio out back. And all the houses are so neat and pretty because they all look just alike. Oh, I dream about it all the time. Just me and the toaster and a sweet little guy like Seymour. A matchbox of our own, a fence of real chain link, a grill out on the patio, disposal in the sink, a washer and a dryer and an ironing machine in a tract house that we share. Somewhere that's green. He rakes and trims the grass. He loves to mow and weed. I cook like Betty Crocker, and I'd look like Donna Reed. There's plastic on our furniture to keep it neat and clean. In the pine so scented air, somewhere that's green. Between our frozen dinner and our bedtime, 9.15, we'd snuggle watching Lucy on our big, enormous 12-inch screen. I'm here's December bride, he's father, he knows best. The kids watch Howdy Doody as the sun sets in the west. A picture of 